Hey everybody and welcome back. Um, today we're going to be continuing um, our my, or my playthrough of um, Zelda the Ancient Stone Tablets. Um, so last week we, or last week, no, last video, we um, did the first dungeon and now um, we are in the second. So not too much to say today, we're just going to head on over, go ahead and get things started. Um, I think my, I don't know if you all could hear that, but my audio was pretty loud for me. Okay, that should be, that should be more appropriate. Okay, um, and audio this time, for you guys should be a lot better than last time, because I did have it a little bit, um, unbalanced last time. Okay, so we're here, whoever here is. And there's fairies for um, no apparent reason, and I don't even I don't need one. Um, listen carefully. If a torch goes out, use the lantern to relight it. Oh, okay. Well, thank you for that uh, most useful piece of advice. Oh, okay. Well, I see why it was telling me that then. Oh, that's, okay, so. Sorry. Nothing really... Oh, is it, yeah, let's go check the other way first. Aha. Alright. Well, that's something. So. Yeah, not a whole lot going on today. Um, pretty lazy day for me. I uh, I was sitting here not doing a whole lot, and I figured I should do some recording because the next two days I won't have um, I won't be able to. My husband's gonna be he has the next two days off, and like it's very hard for me to like. I mean, a lot of times he's in his room, you know, in his uh, office and, like, doing his own thing on his computer and stuff, but, like, even then, I don't know, it's it's just, I'm not, I'm not into that, like, mode yet where I can just be like, yeah, you know, I'm just gonna record, I don't care who's around, like, I don't know. <laughs> I think I just have this disease where I have to pick up every pot, no matter what. Like, even if I have full health or full, like, everything, it's just, it's just a, just a, just a problem I have, I guess. No, that's, that's definitely not what I wanted to do. Um. <clears throat> Alright, we'll see. It seems like, okay. Yeah, one thing with Zelda when I was a kid, I think this might seem like something that a decent amount of people might have done, is when I was young with Zelda, well, with just games in general, I guess, that have maps, I, I was kind of bad at, like, never using them, and, like, sometimes it can be, like, I don't have to, like, especially with a lot of the 2D dungeons, um, I don't really need them, but it does help a lot. Definitely does. It definitely is helpful. I mean, you get that. You get it. So why not utilize it? You know. Dang it. I think that was a big problem for me. I've talked about this before, but I think that was like a big thing for me too. Was um. Uh, just like uh, like. Like, especially in the 3D games, I feel like I didn't use them enough as a kid, and it made things a lot harder, like... Like, for example, the Water Temple is definitely one that I feel like checking the map um, definitely helps some things, I think, at least. Because my biggest problem with the Water Temple in Ocarina was... Um, 
was just keys. Like, I kept, like, getting to new places in the Water Temple, and I would go and get to a point where I wouldn't have a key. Then I'd just have to go back through rooms looking for keys. And, you know, obviously, if you are not dumb like me and you check the map, it's a lot easier to, you know, eliminate places and not keep going back to places you don't even need to, you know. So we got... That's a boomerang. Oh, and that's interesting. It's already the upgraded one, except pretty sure in A Link to the Past, when you get the level 2 boomerang, it, like, has shinies coming off of it, but this, it's, we, we, we don't get the shinies in this version, but that's okay. I, I don't know. I, I've noticed that the stairs in this, like, I don't know if it's because of the version I'm playing on, like, has a problem, or if you would have played it out on the actual system, if it would have had that same problem, but... There's something with the stairs that's up, but it's okay. I won't hold it against it. Um, I don't think I, I'm not gonna go back to those other rooms. Or I think I'm just gonna I'm gonna check out what's down here at least. Yeah, I really, um, I, I don't know what, okay, so I don't know, I don't know, because it happened in the last thing, I don't know what is happening that's allowing me to, like, occasionally get the effects of the medallions, I, I have no idea what that is. Oh, I know what to do here. You can throw the boomerang to grab items. To grab items you can't reach. Thank you. Um. Yeah. I apologize if this if this uh episode might be a bit short. Um. I'll, I'll probably um the next. I'll probably just do the dungeon. Um. After I beat the boss, I'll probably stop here or stop stop. Um. There's a pretty bad storm coming my way, and I don't know how loud it'll get in here, and... I don't have, like, the best, like... Audio, like, set up, because... So, like... I don't know how much of... If the wind really kicks up, I don't know how much you guys are gonna hear, so I apologize if... During the video, if, if the wind kicks up and you guys can hear it, I apologize for that. I don't think it'll get too bad, but... Probably today, I'll just, um, stick to doing this dungeon, and then in the next video, it'll be going to next dungeon, doing next dungeon, so. Split it up occasionally. Ah, uh, okay. I was trying to think of what that key was for, but so I didn't think I passed anything that it needed one. Ooh. Well, alrighty. Well, at least, at least for this, I think the thing that made this boss the most annoying in A Link to the Past was the fact that it was so easy to, um, fall off. Like, I felt like I never really died in this fight, I just kept getting... Uh, hit off the edge, at least that's not in here, but could be, that could be a like, make this harder, or nah, I'm not sure. When he starts going really fast, it might get a bit rough. Well, dang. Well, never mind. I guess they changed him up to be more of a- I mean, he, I guess he's the only the second boss, but I was expecting him to take a little bit longer, but oh well. I can't complain. Oh yeah, it's starting to look pretty, pretty gloomy out there for me. It's 
it's like, it's like 60 or 70 degrees where I'm at, and it's supposed to get down to 30 tonight, so as you can imagine, uh, the storms, storms are brewing. Bringing in that cold wind. I know this is why, I know this is why you all tune in to hear me talk about the weather, but, <laughs> so, it's your lucky day. Oh yeah, I guess I could continue on from what I was saying, because last time I was talking a lot about, um, games I was playing right now and stuff like that, and there was something I was gonna mention that I didn't, and that is that, um, I got the Ace Attorney trilogy on the Switch the other day, and I'm having a lot of fun with it so far. I'm, like, almost done with the second case. Because I saw that it said, because it, it has all, it has the first three games, um, with 14 cases, and I was like, that seems a bit low, but I, I forgot just how long, like, the cases are, so, kind of makes sense then. Because I, I kind of, like, I should have kind of known because I, um, I do, I do know, like, I do know, um, before going in, I knew some of how the Ace Attorney games work because I've played Layton vs. Phoenix Wright, and obviously it switches, um, it, it has, uh, the whole, like, courtroom aspect and stuff in that game. So I knew, I knew a bit. I didn't know, um, that there was a lot of, uh, like, um, point, like, uh, like, point and click elements. I guess that's probably because from what I remember of Leighton versus Phoenix Wright, obviously that more comes into play with Leighton's side because that's a lot of Leighton's games, um, is the whole point and click finding things, but... Okay. Good job collecting the stone tablets, however you've forgotten to get something. You should go look for it. Um, so this should be, because this is the end of week one, obviously, because there's four weeks, you know, we got the two tablets. Um, let me, wait, let me talk to the other guy, maybe he tells me what it is I'm missing, I don't remember doing this. If you want to know more about your items, press the, R oh, okay, well, that's all you're going to tell me. Um... Yeah, I might on my own figure out what it is that I'm missing, and then, you know, next episode, you guys will maybe see me getting it or something like that, or I'll explain. Um, it could- I'm imagining maybe there's something in one of the dungeons I didn't get? Um, I'm not sure, though. But, um, I'll definitely figure it out. Um... Because, yeah, I don't remember doing this my first playthrough. I, there must be something I've just, like naturally missed or something um we can um for here, let me check on yeah we'll um we'll go for a few more minutes and just kind of um kind of loiter around and stuff or not well, you know what i mean we're gonna we're gonna do a little searching see if it's something around here that because there's definitely no mark marks left on the map um but we'll do a little bit of searching Um, okay. So I'm not sure what would- What? What? <laughs> okay, I don't remember this. Is this what we're- is this what we're missing? Cause this seems important. Thank you for saving me. These monsters had chased me all the way into this place. My name is Zelda. I live in Hyrule Castle to the west of here. Uh, yeah, sure. I don't remember doing- uh, Okay. I wonder if this is just a side thing, or if this is, like- Oh, maybe this is what we need to do. I woke up early this morning, and when I looked outside, a ray of light fell from the sky. I felt that something might come looking for that light, finding you collapsed. Okay, I feel like this is what we're supposed to do, because this seems slightly important. I just don't remember this at all. <laughs> at the time, I wondered why you had appeared there. But now I understand why you were brought here. You are the Hero of Light. Yeehaw. You remind me of someone else I know. Someone who saved me in the past. 
No, not just me, but the Kingdom of Hyrule. He was small, but a true hero. Oh. I was able to return safely, thanks to your help. Princess, princess! Why? That is so weird. I, I don't think you ever see that sprite from the side in Only to Pass, because that's very, uh, odd, like, foreign-looking to me. Like, I don't recognize that. Princess, princess, thank goodness you're safe. Where have you been? I'm sorry to have worried you, but I was being chased by monsters. This is the friend who saved me. What? You're the one that saved the princess? But how could such a small child defeat such dangerous monsters? I'm sorry, a person's age doesn't matter. Oh dear, I still have to thank you. Please accept this small rupee reward. Lucky you've received 300 rupees for saving someone's life. Alrighty then. Um... So let me do that way. There's not a whole lot of options here, so like, maybe let's go back and see if that was the big thing we were supposed to do. Oh, come on. Because I really don't think I like- because I got, like, the item of each dungeon, so, like, I don't think that would be the issue. But obviously I might have to check later, but... Okay. Do I maybe need, like, well, the upgrades were just rentals, so I don't know if that would count. Let's just, uh, head back that way. Well, first, let's check- I'm gonna check the map in the first temple over here and see if there's not, like, something somehow major that I missed. But again, I don't- I don't really think that's it, but- Yeah, I really enjoy, like, the 2D games and, like, the combat and stuff. I think- I think the reason why they might get hard for people sometimes is just because of, um... Let me check that cave real quick. Just because, um, the con- like, obviously there's not much of, like, dodging or, you know, stuff like that that's in the 3D combat. So it can feel a little bit easier for, like, um, enemies to, like- feel like they're just- they just get on top of you really quickly. Especially, like, the guards that, like, chase after you and stuff. It can be easy for them to just, like, kind of hop on you. And it can be kind of hard to, like, get away and stuff. Well, usually you just have to resort to, like, running away a bit and then trying to reposition yourself. And all that. So, it can be a little bit more, like, I don't know if clunky is the word I want to use. I guess that'd probably be a good word, I don't know. So that icon is still there for the chest, but I don't know if that just stays there? Because that was where I got the bow last time. I don't know, like, I'm... I don't think that's the answer. If, if, if we don't find it in a bit, I'll, on my own, go back and check in those rooms and make sure I didn't, like, miss something, but... We'll head back the other way and see if there's not something up, like, up... Um, okay, so, <laughs> so, so, what about that? Um, okay. Yeah, it seems like, I don't know what I'm doing to get these perks, but it just seems like at random times I'll just receive, like, stuff, like, good stuff. Like, I don't know. I mean, it's obviously based on the, I don't know if it would just be based on time, though. Yeah, let's go across, because I have not- oh, never mind. Wait, I didn't get- no, no. Well. Oh, wait, I haven't looked over here. No, there's nothing that way. Anything- I'm just oh well not just fairy something I 
hate when I do that. Oh, well. Yeah, we'll check back over here, I guess, and... Uh, well, the rain's coming. I don't know how... <laughs> oh, maybe... Oh, okay. Well, he's just telling me about the boots. go back down to the shop and see if for some reason there's something I need. Welcome, welcome. This is the Riverside Rental Shop. Feel free to look around. Why don't you come inside? Oh, fine. I'll come in. Wait, what, what does he say if I say show me the way forward? Oh, okay. Well, he just tells me about where I've already been. Maybe this, maybe this treasure is something. Um, well, let's go get that, and then I think after I get the treasure, depending on what it is, we will, we will call it a day. Because I hear the storm picking up, and again, I don't want, I don't know how people's ears will be blasted. Um, we were like right on it. Yeehaw! Okay. Um, I think I'll go ahead and save right here. And, um, I'm gonna go ahead and pause just because since this is, you know, um, since it is timed, I don't know. I, 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 I assume that it being. Even when it's paused, I assume it, the time might... I, I don't know. I'm not going to take any chances. But, um... But yeah, so that'll do it for this part. Um, I, I will... I don't know what that I was... I don't know what that I was, I was saying. Um, I will be, um, figuring that on my own and seeing what it is, the final... It's probably... I don't think it would be that hard, like, container, but I'll, I'll probably go back and make sure. And I will figure out what it is I need... To move on and then we'll go from there and stuff so but like you obviously don't want to just see minutes and minutes of me just roaming around but um so i'll figure that out and next time we will um start what should be week two um and we will do the third we will go and get the third stone tablet um so yeah that should be it for this week's um or for this episode um i'll probably be back with part three in just a few days or something um so hey thank you all for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!